Well, Andre, the board discussed this issue for more than two hours tonight, even going into a closed session at one point and then coming back. But the vote was split five to five, whether to renew the school's charter. They ultimately voted to defer the vote until their next meeting. CEO Sonia Santalisis recommended renewing with several conditions, like hiring more qualified teachers, complying with course requirements and school discipline procedures. Some board members expressed concern that the school would be able to make, make those changes given that their charter was renewed three years ago with conditions as well. The school CEO watched the virtual meeting at the school and says they put in a new leadership team to address the issues and they're hopeful the board will give them the opportunity to continue their work. We feel that though the vote did not, you know, there's not a definitive answer in the vote tonight, we're optimistic that uh, members of the board, if they give a little bit more time and consideration, um, that they may see that the, the, the moves that we made, the recommendation of uh, not only the CEO, but her Office of New Initiative, who works closely with us, um, that they've really worked with us to get us in a new direction. The school will take the board rather will take up the issue for a vote at their meeting on Tuesday. Reporting live downtown, Kim Dacey, WBAL TV 11 News.